As of today, January 4th, 2016, uh, this is the oldest figure that is going to be opened on Vintage Toy Freedom. This is Dick Tracy, The Tramp, and this is from 1990. It's made by Playmates, the same company that did uh, Star Trek and Ninja Turtles and a bunch of other lines. They, they seem to have a lot of movie properties. So... This was kind of a, a a cool line. I don't I haven't met too many people who it's it's their favorite. Um, most notable by the blank, as you can see there. Which spoiler alert, if you haven't seen this movie in the past twenty seven years, um, is actually Madonna. And I'm not super familiar with this line, but from what I understand, that figure was only released in Canada. Uh, so you know, obviously it's on the back of the American card, so it was it was pretty hard to find. So. You know, some of these guys are kind of cool. I like Flat Top. You know, there's Mumbles. Um, the one guy, I think it's Lips Manless. Uh, one of the guys actually comes with these cinder block things that kind of go on his ankles. So you can obviously throw him in the in the water so he can sleep with the fishes. So this is Steve the Tramp. Um, he's an ignorant bum with cauliflower ears, dirty and scarred from a life in the streets. You'll smell him before you see him. So not not too politically correct, but... Oh well, I wonder how many people saved fingerprint points and what, what you could have done with those. So I kind of like the card art, it's cool. You know, you got the old Dick Tracy strip on there. Um, but this guy's kind of cool. He's, you know, the, the bubble's peeling, it's yellowed, it's faded. I got it for, I think, eight bucks ship, so not too terribly great. Um, so as I'm opening this, I'm gonna tell you a little bit about sort of my connection to the Dick Tracy line. It was, you know, when it came out, it was, um, you know, it was a cool movie. You know, you had Warren Beatty, you had Madonna. Um, it wasn't it wasn't a bad movie. There were trading cards and obviously different uh, sort of tie-ins. But uh, a couple years after this, I guess it would have been 92. Uh, it was the year that Duke played Arkansas in the NCAA championship. I remember that. And I went to Hilton Head, South Carolina with my grandparents. And there was this toy store that was kind of bootleg. It was... Um, I don't know, it was like a mom and pop place, and, you know, they, they didn't really have anything great. It was kind of like a, I don't know, maybe like an overstock kind of place. I remember I got this set of baseball cards for like five bucks, but it was like, you know, we're, it's 92, and these were like an 89 series or something like that. So, you know, just a lot of outdated stuff. And I remember they had a lot of Dick Tracy figures, but, you know, especially at that time, it was well past its prime, but... That's my fascinating story about the Dick Tracy toy line. So he comes with a piece of wood, and he comes with a garbage can lid and a knife. And, you know, so he can shank people, he can hit people with his, his wooden plank. He doesn't stand very well. His legs are kind of janky, I guess, from his life on the streets. So... Anywho, so that's Steve the Tramp. Um, I think these are cool sculpts. You know, they're all pretty unique. They have some interesting accessories. You know, how many people come with a, a plank of wood. So, uh, you know, thanks for watching. I, I hope you enjoyed this. Again, this is you know, kind of a quick one, but just kind of a, you know, not a real popular line, not, not a whole lot going on with it, um, other than the blank, which obviously some people's holy grails, if you ever find one, that's, um, kudos to you. So, thanks for watching, and watch out for those bad guys.